Nick, where do you feel your game's at coming off a win like that and success from your line? Um, yeah, we're playing really good. Uh, I think it's just um, doing all the little details, cleaning up some things from yesterday. Um, so yeah, it's been good. What does a win like this do for the group, especially into this final stretch before the playoffs? Uh, yeah, hopefully we can use this as a springboard to kind of just continue to grow our game. And uh, obviously points are at a premium this time of year. So as long as we can continue to collect those, it's just uh, it's good. Knowing you have a lot of divisional games coming up and the type of game we saw out there, pretty gritty, pretty spicy in the second period, what are you expecting down the stretch? Um, yeah, just a lot more of that. Uh, obviously, you know, everyone's kind of in the mix right now. You know, every team's got an opportunity to make the playoffs, so everyone's going to be fighting for these points. So I think just expect a lot more of that and probably even raise the level. What do you think is working for you right now as you, you know, continue to put up points here in the last stretch of games? Um, obviously, our line's playing really well. Um, I don't know, just continuing to gain confidence right now and just use that as best I can and uh, hopefully just continue to ride this as long as we can. Logan, a successful night for the club, but also a successful night for your line. What's working so well for you guys? I, I think we just have good chemistry. Um, you know, our message to each other on the bench is just play the right way and good things will happen for us. And, um, you know, we like playing with each other. We like having the puck. Um, but, we, you know, we are trying to do do it right and put the puck in deep when we have to. And I think with, with our line and with, uh, you know, Belly and, and, and my size and Bruiser's ability to make plays that um, we can outplay teams in their end of the ice, you know, behind their goal line. Like, we don't have to be fancy and play high all the time. So, um, yeah, it was nice to obviously have an, a, a good night, but uh, it was a big, big game for for us as a team and uh, those points were, were really mean a lot to us. Speaking of the points meaning a lot, how impressed were you with your team's ability to like keep it even keeled even in that second period when things were starting to heat up? Yep, I thought uh, you know our response in the third period was was, was very nice. It's got a couple times this year that we just kind of stuck with it um, and, and trusted trusted ourselves and trusted the, the process. But I think uh, you know you got to give a lot of credit to Cavill and he made some big saves uh, throughout the whole game that kept us in it. And uh, you know if one or two of those go in, then you're you're kind of you know you're squeezing your stick a little bit tighter. But um, so it was it was great for him to to be able to backstop us there all night and um, again we just we just our special teams was good we just had a I think we played a pretty pretty round out, rounded game what can a game like this do for the team moving forward and how can you use it as inspiration in this last stretch yeah it's uh, I mean if you look at the standings every game for us right now means means a lot so it's not just uh, against uh, division opponents which these were but um, so we come out of this you know weekend with, against Rochester with a, with a split which is nice but um, you know we had another big game tomorrow everyone that this whole north division is very very tight and um, it, it's, it's I think it's going to benefit us that every game is a playoff game um, so it's, it's a lot of fun to be a part of and it's pretty easy to get up for You've been around a long time, so you've done these three and threes before, but is it still taxing? Do you still uh, find a little challenge to it? It doesn't get easier as you get older, for sure. Um, but to be honest, with the, the way the league is now, um, you know, we, we only have two this year, where I think when I was in Portland, we were between like eight and ten uh, throughout the year. And I think even if you look at the schedule, if you look at like a Springfield, they have eight again this year. So we're very fortunate on that side of things. And how well we get treated here in, in our travel isn't that bad. So I think... Uh, um, yeah, it's tough, but to be honest, it's, it's, it's nice to play games that matter.